The 2013 Veterans Salute honoring all who serve brought information and resources to our Valley veterans. The fifth annual event was held at the Texas Army National Guard Armory in Wessico. Congressman Ruben Hinojosa encouraged veterans to take advantage of all the opportunities offered during the event. The organizers of this event have brought together a variety of resources that will help you and your families access benefits and the support services you need. Those services included VA benefits, GI Bill information for higher education, vocational rehabilitation services, and employment opportunities. Uh, we have the VFW here, we have the American Legion here, uh, we have a lot of different organizations, we have DPS here, they're hiring people if you guys need a job. Wessico Mayor Mike Weiss stressed the significance of helping not only veterans, but their families as well. It is so important that we reach out to young veterans, we, we reach out to their families as well. We must recognize one of our nation's greatest responsibility to ensure that our veterans, uh, by their families, receive lasting and comprehensive support. As Valley leaders and legislators work to bring a VA hospital to the Valley, Assistant Director of Veteran Affairs Dana Malone explained how important it was for all veterans to register with the VA and be counted. One of our goals at the VA is to increase enrollment in our health care system. Unfortunately, sometimes when we're dealing with our returning veterans, we find it somewhat of a challenge recruiting them into the VA. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to tell you that today's VA is not the VA of the past. And I challenge you today to step up to the plate and get your veteran friends, family members, and neighbors to enroll today. Hundreds of veterans and their families were treated to games, live music, and a hearty barbecue meal. Keynote speaker Dr. Raul Aguilar said it best when he said, Our continued appreciation for a veteran and their service to our country can go a long way. I ask that each of you offer a sincere thank you to a veteran not only today but every day. A simple thank you means more to most veterans than any other reward.